they're not going the other way any longer behind Shane Bouchelle. From going forward, this is going to be a prolific football program. On first down, the AAC's leading rusher, Ulysses Bentley, across the 40-yard line, out of bounds after a gain of 21. <laughs> Experienced, disruptive pass rusher versus a redshirt freshman offensive tackle. Keep an eye on that tonight. Now, Thomas was banged up last week. He did dress in warm-ups, but not out for the first series. And there's a strike to Rashi Rice. Another first down. Keelan Stokes back deep to return the punt by Nagar. And this one bounces and is downed inside the five. See if he can get on point here on his first third down opportunity. Smith pressured. Intercepted. Crossley. Pick six. Well, well, well. That plays right into really the cycle that we've seen from Tulsa. He throws off balance late, tries to dump down, throws a high throw. Second and 12 now. Bentley again, bounces to the outside. Bentley's got great speed, and takes it inside the 15. A flag is down. Empty set, third and 11. Bouchel to the air. Now he steps up. Steps, throws, touchdown, Kylan Granson. Credit he's due for his athleticism. Look at him see the field. Now he's going to step up, take the front door. But instead of running, he keeps his eyes downfield. That's experience. That's poise. Use your 11 personnel. Go right at him. Smith with time. Took too much time. And sacked by Turner Cox. Third and goal. MU will begin at the 20-yard line. Bentley in the backfield. Bouchel to the air. Has an open Danny Gray. Another penalty marker down. That's exactly what the recipe needs to be. Play selection. Even eight runs. Eight passes. Bentley speeding all the way inside the 10-yard line. I'm SMU. I am running the football. Heavy run set here. They run it. It's Bentley. And he coasts in for a touchdown. I mean, Tulsa's got to have some type of, con you know, contested. Bouchelle can't get away. Sacked by Anthony Goodlow, his third of the season. Marcus Bryant, the young redshirt freshman who's just not capable right now of handling what Tulsa can bring along the defensive front. Look like a well-oiled machine right now. Oh, by the way, we're in the middle of the second quarter. Middle of the second quarter. That's when it usually happens. Smith moving the pocket. Denbo coming on the blitz. He's got Johnson. Touchdown, Tulsa. <laughs> we, we were supposed to have a couple of Tulsa games earlier this year, so we've watched a lot of film on these guys. Yeah. And I go back to a text that you sent me. On the RPO. Here's Collins. And Bouchel throws it away. The Tulsa sideline wants grounding. And this one between the uprights. Is good. SMU tacks on three more. Showing some hurry up. I like how they're using this. 2.20 to go. Four-man rush. Smith is sacked. Zach Smith's old school. A 300 pounder. Final He's time, only time, time out of the half. Tulsa. If they're Maybe just... they're trying to see if SMU's going to stop the clock. Oh, they'll call play with about 16 on the play clock. And Cox drops Smith. So two sacks on the drive. It can also be a factor in the throw game. A strong arm can cut through it, but can also affect accuracy. TK Wilkerson. With a nice run across the 35-yard line. I would imagine that's got to beef up your forearms. Here's Absolutely. Prince. 
has an opening inside the 25 all the way into the red zone stevens made the tackle see if this tulsa defense steps up gets this ball back and works field position bouchelle on the keeper still going and shane bouchelle with a first down and more but this could be coming back on second and ten bouchelle hit has Rushy Rice. They haven't hit a lot of big plays through the air tonight, but that's a big one. Boy, Shane Buchel gets hammered right here. But well, what a terrific throw on the back shoulder down the seam. First down, Keelan Stokes still going. Driven out by Clay in SMU territory. Poise. Climbs the pocket, sees the field, delivers with a guy in his face. Accurate. I mean, that was that was fantastic. And and maybe just maybe they're setting up the pop pass here. Wilkerson makes his way in. See Wilkerson here. So worried about stopping quarterback run. Kicking into the wind. There's Crossley. Took an interception back for a touchdown and upended. Yikes across the 35 yard line. Wilkerson shedding tacklers. Second level. Still going to the 35 yard line of SMU. Want to load the box, we're going to throw the quick screen to the perimeter. This 11 personnel has been the difference in the game in the second half. Five-man pressure, it's picked up. Wide open, Josh Johnson! <laughs> Montgomery. Yeah, it's just a bust uh, of coverage and miscommunication. Gray. He's fast. Swift as a shadow. Still going. And Danny Gray flashing the wheels That's and the agility. And another first down for SMU. <laughs> 29 yards for Gray. Well, I stand corrected on the five-yard out into the wind. Shane Bouchel. Bouchelle under pressure, steps up, he'll run. And Shane Bouchelle able to slide down for a first down. Underappreciated athleticism to take the front door, get up, tuck the ball, now get down. Ooh. Oh, that's dangerous there by Allie Green. Very dangerous. Immediately getting upfield to get the line to gain. Tulsa's got all three timeouts. Going right back to Stokes. Across the 30. Deep in SMU territory, inside the 25. Stokes has been able to separate. Sixth career 100-yard game for Stokes. TK Wilkerson up the middle, charging ahead. Another first down for Tulsa. Back to 11 personnel here. Smith to throw. He's got Palmer, who reaches across. James Palmer, his first career touchdown, and he puts Tulsa ahead. Second catch of the season, first career touchdown. A little extra effort in Tulsa leading for the first time tonight. Riley by putting their battering ram in on the short yardage situation. Bouchelle intercepted. Zavin Collins seals it for Tulsa. But we may be even talking about Tulsa potentially, the way they can finish the season as a group of five New Year's 16. That's going to seal it. Wilkerson picking up the first down that it's probably why we're out of rhythm and disjointed when we start every game. After getting their hearts broken by SMU a season ago in triple overtime, Tulsa gets revenge tonight.
Thanks for watching ESPN on YouTube. For live streaming sports and premium content, subscribe to ESPN+.